On this Linux Gamecast how-to, we're installing Holy Spirit Act of Faith from Subversion. Now, if building a game from source is not your thing, you can go to holyspirit.fr and download the binary and the updater. The only catch, it's in French. But if that's your thing, you might want to skip this video. But on this how-to, we're going to add a new PPA to our system add new dependencies, build something using CMake, and clone a subversion repository. And if that sounds like fun, let's go. Let's install Holy Spirit. And we're going to use the short guide I've put together on linuxgamecast.com. Let's open a terminal on the desktop because we need to install our SFML2 PPA. Just copy and paste. Key in your password and accept. Press enter. After that, sudo apt-git update to refresh everything. Now that's done, we need to get together all of our dependencies. You're probably going to need more than what's listed here, and that's what's listed in the Holy Spirit Linux README. And that should definitely get you started. Now here comes the long part. We're going to pull the subversion repository. It's about 600 megabytes, so depending on your connection speed, take quite a while. Now that that's done, we can close out this terminal session. And we should have a Holy Spirit folder on our desktop. Now from here, we're going to navigate to trunk, source. And we need to create a build folder. So just make directory build. See the end of that, and run cmake space dot dot. Now we're going to run the make command minus j with the number of how many physical cores you have on your machine. I have a quad core, so I chose four. And that's done. We should have a binary executable of Holy Spirit. And we're going to take that and copy it to our trunk. So let's copy, move to our trunk directory, and paste it. Now from here, you could play the game, but unless you speak French, it might be a little bit difficult. Let me show you. Can be a bit off. You might be able to navigate around, but... Let's put it in English. So open your configuration.conf. Now let's scroll down to the bottom under language and change fr underscore fr to en underscore en. And save that. And have another go. Simple as that.